Peas family, how are you guys? Hope all is well. Guess where I'm at? Well, guess where I'm on my way, right? I'm in the cut, 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 right? But this is our beloved ancestors, right? Uh, this is Harriet Tubman's um, route, okay? I'm going the back ancient way to where she's at. And then as soon as I get settled down here, right? I'm gonna call you guys. I'm gonna call you guys, right? Because um, I'm on my way to the actual river. This right here is just like the wooded area, right? But it's so pretty out here, right? You'd be amazed, look at that. Whose planet is this? Like our sister say, this is our planet. And then like out here is the valleys and hills and mountains. It's like the as in of the Appalachian Mountains, right? So um, it's a lot of history out here. It's a lot of ancient energy out here as well. That's why I'm always out here, right? Yeah, you got a part in me. I got my daughter's car. She got to get some kind of little pipe on there. It's getting on my nerves. Greetings. Yeah, see, out here, we don't have them problems. But here we go, because I'm getting ready to get out. But look at that. This is the path, right? That our beloved ancestor, right? Carry it to. And I'm getting ready to stop right here, because I don't really... Because if you go up too far, right, it's a, um, it's a lot of rocks and dirt roads and stuff. So I choose to come right here, right? I'm going to put my hazards on part in me, you guys. I wanted to share this experience with you, right? I hear a car coming. It is what it is, right? So, so yeah, this is what we call the brandy wine, right? This is actually where Harriet and our ancestors traveled. This is a large river, you guys. I'm trying to get up a little bit. <coughs> I'm trying to get up a little bit so you guys can see it. You see that? This this river leads all the way up to uh New Jersey. And I think it starts out I think it starts in, um, I want to say Virginia or Maryland, right? But this is the path Harriet took, right? And I'm always out here. You see that river? You see it? So you can imagine, and like up in this area, right? Because we're, we're surrounded by, um, this is a valley. Right? I live in what's called the valley, right? The hills and the valleys, if you can see, right? Um, like over in this area, all of that is like valleys. It's so pretty. Uh, also, there are nature trails out here. There are waterfalls. Even like a lot of, if there's like um, places which you would call peddler's fruit, right? Part and stuff. Um, yeah, so what we call peddler's fruit, and there's a lot of deer out here, things of that nature. So if they were hungry and things of that nature, I mean, it's plenty of natural things uh, in this area that they would be able to survive off of, right? See? See the path? You go up that path, that path is actually going to take you up to a semi-mountain, right? Yeah. It's beautiful out here, right? I wish you guys uh, could come join me. And then you see like all of the rocks. The rocks are so ancient out here. And we have like, Delaware is like a colonial state and it's still preserved like that. So a lot of places that you go, um, there are actual, see that, look at that. And this thing goes for miles and miles and miles. This is just one way out that I like to come to because I don't like to be around a lot of people when I'm out meditating with our, you know, ancestral energy. I also come out this way to get certain messages, right? 
Um, I forgot what I was just saying because I thought it was kind of important, but <laughs> it is what it is, right? But I wanted to share this with you guys. Let me show you. I'm going to go up a little bit. It's so pretty out here. And like I said, across from here, when you go up this way, if you go through that little cut, you're getting up. You, you know, they could uh, easily hide all through here. Easily hide because it's mountains, right? It's a river and it's valley, right? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, like um, Delaware is a very colonial state. So you would find like these type of rocks and like a lot of cobblestone. Right? A lot of these houses here are built in cobblestone. It's gorgeous. Don't you ever let anybody tell you that Delaware is ghetto. They don't know what the hell they're talking about, right? Because, see, a lot of times when people come to um, certain cities and states, they only go to the ghetto. You know what I mean? I'm from the soil of here. Yeah, my family was millionaires and shit in the 50s. You know, so I've been blessed to see, you know, all of the jewels. This is also... Um, out where a lot of the uh, so-called elite, I guess you want to say, lives as well, right? And uh, plenty of fish, thing, things of that nature. You cannot, I, don't, I would not eat fish out of here now. However, right, um, I'm going to go down a little bit. Because one thing about your sister, right, I hate freaking grass. Okay? I'll let anybody know that. I hate motherfuckers. Pardon me for cursing, but I hate grass. But, uh, see? Look at that. Phil Cobweb. But yeah. This is the river. I wouldn't eat fish, but at one, you know, this, this, let me tell you something. Now that COVID has came, right? Um, last year when I came out here, this water was so muddy. It was just disrespectful. I was like, please, it gotta be a way to get our planet clean again, right? So during COVID, I don't know, but now that I come out here, this water is crystal clear. It's unbelievable how clear it is. And it's very beautiful. So, uh, yeah, there's a lot of fish, you know, people been fishing. My mom used to bring us down here to fish a lot too, right? But, um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys, right? So, you guys spent the day with me, Harriet, <laughs> and the ancestors down at the, uh, what's known as the Brandywine River, a.k.a. the direct route, right, to freedom of the Underground Railroad, right? Um, also... When I come out, right, there's words that I speak, right? Because, uh, and I should have did it before I came and, you know, walked on this soil, right? But, uh, you know, we greet the ancestors in our native tongue. Okay, here come the pilgrims. And go. Um, I greet the ancestors uh, with the words of, because um, um, I want to do it before I go. But um, I greet the ancestors with the words of Allah, all right? And then I ask, right? Because we can go this way. Because I'm going to go back to my to my whippy poo, right? So then I go, um, Allah, greetings, right? And then uh, I ask them, I say, semi loa pelo me, right? And that means guide and protect me to and from. Right? Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to give you a little bit of um, this paradise in history, you guys. Right? Right? So nobody can ever tell you you never been to uh, Brandywine Harriet Tubman's River and Rail Underground Railroad. There's a lot of places around here that's actually named after Harriet, right? I mean, a lot. Not a little bit, but a lot, right? Yeah. See that? Creek. <laughs> Gorgeous. Thought I shared that. I'm almost at 10 minutes, you guys. With that being said, keep your vibrations high. And I'm out. Peace.